Hello, Chris and Dan Show. Thank you very much. The prize money as of this is, I think, 165 but check under the video description to be sure. Today's request comes from a viewer named hey, Samuel Angle. Before we get into that, we haven't given the rundown on the rules of the contest in like six or seven videos. So Yeah, I was just going to do it. All right. So today's comment comes from Samuel Angle. Every video, basically, we increase it to $5 for the prize money if nobody wins if nobody wins normally it's a rock that i have to react to or a rap that chris has to react to mm -hmm. so only the scores of the person who's reacting counts so nine out of ten will they buy it is it a genre buster will they buy the song basically will they rate it nine out of ten or ten out of ten mm -hmm. um so far only one person's won on disturbed thanks to me I rated it a nine and uh, people have come close night of fish and mm. um, main, main skin. skin. And today Samuel Engel came from one of those videos and he said, Hey, check this one out, but you have to subscribe guys to win the money. So subscribe and then comment. And if we feature it and we try to get to all the comments, although man, let me tell you the army's been coming them. out. Yeah, a lot yeah, the, of them. The army's been coming out. But anyways, let's get into it. Samuel Engel recommended Dimash Quadri Bergen. Mm, he said it's not... Glad it's, you're playing this. I don't know if I can pronounce that. Yeah, it's not rap or rock. It's just musical masterpiece at the Slavic Bazaar. Okay. So it sounds like maybe where my dad is from in uh, well, Serbia. It, so it's not rap or, or rock. Can it win? It could win. If we both rated it, if one of us rates this a 9 out of 10, yeah. All right. So this is actually a smart strategy because now only one of us has to rate this a nine or, or a 10. All right. We rec we take other requests, guys, other sure. genres. Обладатель Гран-при международного конкурса исполнителей эстрадной песни Витебск 2000. I think this is Serbian. I've been there like three times and my dad's born there. I have no All idea you people that say Americans are, well, I don't know what they say, Americans. I'm, look, I'm not even born in this country, all right? Relax. Take a chill pill. 2015, Dimash Kudaybergen, Kazakhstan. So this guy's from Kazakhstan. All they right. just said that. Yeah, I caught that. Like Borat. Yeah. They're loving it. Look at the crowd is loving. This dude's about to drop some bars. He looks rather young. Yeah. Let's listen. Let's, let's listen. They say we pause too much. You only paused a dozen times there, but what? The oh, 13th. that was Chris's fault, guys. <laughs> I Go said you've only paused it a dozen times so far, but okay. Let's go, Kazakhstan. Whoa. <laughs> well, yeah, no, Dude, where'd that come from? <laughs> this went from Celine Dion to like uh, Garth Brooks. Yeah, uh, that was just uh, surprising as hell. Let me tell you, this has a chance. Pause it. Was that screaming right there? No, that's singing. Okay. I'm just curious because some people say rock music when they do that, it's screaming. It's not, it's singing. Okay, go on. Yeah, we'll definitely compare it to some of the stuff he put on. Although the stuff he put on lately has been good. Oh, 
m'attire, qui m'attire, qui m'attire, volé. This is like trippy, man. This is more trippy than the some of those rock songs where they go to hell. <laughs> this guy's changing his voice. He's going from place. angelic to yeah, like Yeah, he's all, all over the place. Yeah, man. This is good. Wow. So, somehow this dude mixes. Mosco. So I guess the rest is their reactions to it, but somehow this dude makes his testicles disappear and then reappear. I don't know how he does it. <laughs> don't know how he does it. Man, voice 10 out of 10. I should say 20 out of 10. He can do two. He yeah. can go Mariah Carey and yeah. he can go, I don't know, Garth Brooks, like I yeah. said. Yeah. I mean, 10 out of 10, 20 out of 10. You know, He's two. Got, got, Got an awesome voice. Uh, I would agree. Um, I wasn't I, halfway through. I stopped reading the lyrics because it doesn't matter. Yeah. I, I, I'm just giving... listening to his uh, voice. Awesome voice. Uh, it's not something I would buy, though. So, I mean, his voice alone, I would agree with you. is 10 out of 10. But it's just not something I would buy. Yeah. Um, it's not something I would choose to listen to. But if you put it on, like if you were to buy it and I was in the car, I'd be like, oh, that's cool. Now I'm gonna be but, a troll here, but I wouldn't buy it. I'm gonna be a troll here, and I'm just joking, but I'm not. But I am. You're not, if, but you are. Okay. Let's replace the main skin lead singer with this guy, right? Oh, you're gonna piss off some main skin. <laughs> <laughs> let's go. Maybe that'll get. And maybe he can learn English, and then ten out of ten. Yeah, put him on right. a rock band. Put this wow. dude in a rock band. No, I agree with you. Voice twenty out of ten. Song. I mean, it's listenable. It's absolutely of listenable. It's listenable. If you know, if I was in the right mood, I might give it a nine. I just not. No, I wouldn't. I, I don't think I could. Because maybe I, I'm I have giving to it like understand a, the language. I at least I, have to understand like a good amount of the language to actually yeah, want to buy it. See, I don't. I you're more open minded. I've purchased many songs that I don't understand what the hell they're talking about. But there's an American for you guys. But it's got to have more than just the singing. I got to have like something I relate to in the on the music side of it. Yeah. So, you know, the music side of it just wasn't doing it for me. I mean, I would give the song overall like a seven, seven and a half. That's what I was going to do, too. Yeah, I have it at a seven. Not something I would, you know, come out and say, hey, let's listen to that or buy it. 
But yeah. if you put it on, I'd be like, oh yeah, this is this is great. This guy could sing. Be blown away. Yeah. Yeah. Twenty twenty out of ten voice. Seven out of ten overall for the song and yeah. you know everything. But I think the commenter Samuel Engel knew that too. He just wanted to see us react to it. And sure, it's, yeah, it's, it's a, amazing. Dude can sing. I mean, yeah. Yeah. Let us know if he's been on something else. Like I don't know. Yeah. Like actual yeah. release the song or something. I mean, yeah. it sounds like this one. I mean, this is more like opera, really. Yeah. This is, really reminds me of opera, like um, like an Italian opera or something. Like Flor from Nightwish. You know, she does it. Yeah. She does it like this. But that's that has music that I can relate to. Right. Uh, opera is just, just not for me. Right. And uh, Main Skin also pretty good. I, I just joking about the lead singer. He's actually right. good. Right. But this guy better? Yes. All right. Yeah. Yeah, he's right, up there with, he's right up there with the Nightwish singer. Hey, he's right up there with uh, the guy from Queen. Yeah. I mean, voice wise, what's his name? Freddie Mercury. Yeah. All right. Awesome stuff. Thank you, Samuel Angle. Yes. The pot keep it up. keeps getting bigger. Somebody's got to win because at some point we're going to run out of money. We won't be able to pay. We're going to be like the United States. You guys like to make fun of <laughs> the United States? Well, we're going to be like the United States. Yeah, it can't be their China debt. says, hey, pay up on your debt. We're going to be. Very American. How fitting of us <laughs> to get to the point where we owe a trillion dollars to somebody and they don't do it. So anyways, I got to go. But thank you guys very much for watching, listening. Make sure you subscribe. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.